Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. As reported by PTI, India's first indigenous flying trainer Hansa NG designed and developed by National Aerospace Laboratories Bangalore has successfully completed the sea level trials at Puducherry from 19th February to 5th of March. The aircraft was flown to Puducherry covering 140 nautical miles in one and a half hours at a cruising speed of 155 km per hour on 19th February. The objectives of sea level trials were to evaluate handling capabilities, climb and cruise performance, bark landing, structural performance, power plant and other system performance. The sea trials are important for certification of any aircraft as the air above the sea level has varying level of humidity and other factors which can change the aerodynamic performance of an aircraft. As per NAL, all the objectives of the sea level trials are met and aircraft has been ferried back to Bangalore on 5th of March after completing 8 hours flying at Puducherry. The aircraft was piloted by Wing Commander KV Prakash and Wing Commander Dilip Reddy of ASTE. The very first version of the aircraft was called NAL Hansa, which is an Indian all-composite low-wing tricycle gear two-seater general aviation monoplane for flight training as well as personal training. Hansa MG is its upgraded version. It was designed by National Aerospace Laboratories of India under NAL Light Aircraft Project. It is one of the most advanced flying trainer powered by digitally controlled Rotax 912 ISC engine with unique features like just-in-time prep rig, composite lightweight airframe, glass cockpit, bubble canopy with wide panoramic view and electrically operated flaps and long endurance. Hansa MG is designed to meet Indian flying club's need and it is an ideal aircraft for commercial pilot licensing due to its low cost and low fuel consumption. Hansa took its first flight in 1993 and full certification from DGCA in 1998. Hansa NG took its first flight in September 2021. The production variant was built by Taneja Aerospace and Aviation Limited. Total 15 Hansa and one Hansa NG aircraft has been built till date. NAL has already received more than 80 letter of intents from various flying clubs. The NAL director Jitendra J. Jadav said a total of 37 flights and 50 hours of flying have been completed and few more flights will be conducted before getting type certification by DGCA. Type certification is likely to be complete by April and thereafter the manufacturing will be initiated with public or private industry that will enhance the aerospace ecosystem under Atm Nirbhar Bharat. Many of you might get confused as HL Kiran was the first indigenous trainer designed and developed by HL and took its first flight back in 1964. The important thing to understand here is that Kiran was developed by HL for Indian Air Force pilot training requirement of a new intermediate jet powered trainer aircraft. It was not meant for civilian use. However, Hansa NG is being developed for training of the commercial pilots. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and jai hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.